here we are folks an impromptu greeting with Steve Jewell or the hammer as you like to call me and Steve how long have you been coal plunging in Lake Harriet yeah right behind us is uh, Lake Harriet Magic Coal I've been coming here since 2020 2020 and uh, how long have you been practicing the Wim Hof method you know I didn't learn about Wim until I started doing this so the Iceman came to me afterwards but there's quite a crew that do this uh, this daily plunging and we look forward to the lake freezing up so we can cut a nice 10 by 10 foot hole yeah. with he, a ladder. He's been doing Wim for four or five years. Yeah, <laughs> right. so. Let's check out the sunset. I mean, what, this awesome? is this is your time, right? This is my time. Come on up if you want a and, beautiful sunset. And, and for people watching and stuff, give us two tips for going into ice a hole in the ice. Yeah, so that, for newbies, for those that have never done ice before, obviously you want to have some footwear, whether it's neoprene boots like these bad boys here, and or they're basically scuba boots, if you will. Five mil is just fine. Make sure you have a nice water resistant, wind resistant shell. And so then, a robe is not gonna do it. It's the wind will cut right through it. And then what about breathing technique? What, what's something that gets you in that mindfulness place when you're going through a hole in the ice? Yeah, so once I get in the water, me personally, I like to lower my shoulders from that hunched up hyper hyperventilating mode and slow my breathing down look into the sun, take deep breaths in, and relax. And my body responds. Right on, brother. All right, thank you so much. Cheers, brother. See you in the hole. Right on.